That's terrible. It's terrible. It can't be done. I know, Mary, it's difficult, but they are his last wishes, and I'm sure you and the family would like to carry them out as best you could. He is your father, after all. Why can't you be buried like everyone else, Doctor? Imagine want to be buried at sea. No, worse again, his ashes scattered on the waves. Well, it can't be done. And that's the end of it. I couldn't help it over here what the doctor said. What are you going to do, Mary? Oh, I just don't know, Joan. He must have lost his senses to come up with a request like that. According to the doctor, he was of sound mind. But then again, was he ever of sound mind? <laughs> I'll have to go down now to Father Cassidy and see will he allow his ashes into the church. You'll be lucky if he allows his body in, never mind his ashes. <laughs> they never hit it off them two, always at each other's throats. Do you know, Joan, I think this is his roundabout way of telling us he doesn't want to go to the church. Well, he's going now whether it's in a box or a jar. <laughs> Now that himself is gone, you know yourself, Mary, he wasn't an easy man to get on with. May he rest in peace. <laughs> It'll be a big funeral. Oh, I don't know about that. There's not that many boats in the area. Boats? What do they want boats for? No, oh, no. Me and my big mouth. Well, you might as well know now as later. He's to be buried at sea. Ah, oh, God almighty. Who put that idea in their heads? It was the last wishes of himself. Oh. I might have known the last request of an alcoholic. Bury me deep in the drink. Look, they have crematoriums up there where his body will be burnt hygienically. Like an incinerator? That's it. His body goes in one end and the ashes come out the other. <laughs> Much like a range, I suppose. That's it. <laughs> Only there'd be no sush. <laughs> drank then. Mostly whiskey we drank, <coughs> when we could get it. So you'll have a whiskey then? Uh, in a pint glass, if you don't mind. <laughs> Spilling that. <laughs> In nomine patris et filius spiritus sancti, mis tu tu I am beportus duel, e dismisses pucatus tuus, pucatei vitam eternam, e morte after lobo after vicatus tuus. In nomine patris et filius spiritus sancti. I didn't think it not just father. I'm having a way bit of trouble with me new teeth. <laughs> Your teeth. <laughs> That's a good one. Uh, now that you mention it, Mary, they do look a bit familiar. <laughs> ah, but no, they couldn't be. Why? What happened? I tell you what happened. <laughs> that clown there forgot to put the lead weights in the body bag. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Right now, my dearly beloved late departed father is bobbing about like a disco dancer on his white crystal grave. <laughs> I'm 
soaked. Has anybody seen my cheese? <laughs>